chapter 5 functions and graph continue on 5.1 functions these are the learning outcome for these subtopics cash a constant function constant function is a straight line so examples fx equal negative 3 fx also considered as y equal negative 3 y negative 3 is here and then draw a straight line at y equal negative 3 and then label the graph fx equal negative 3 next example x equal to 2 a constant function where x equal to 2 is here so draw a straight line where x equal to and label the graph x equal to 2 so for every value of y x equal to 2 and then linear function to sketch a linear function we need two points normally we put x equal to 0 or also known as y intercepts and y equal to 0 this is x intercepts okay for x equal to 0 substitute x into the function y equal to 4 x is 0 plus 1 so y equal to 1 and for y equal to 0 x equal to negative 1 over 4 and then sketch the point when x equal to 0 y equal to 1 here when x equal negative 1 over 4 y equal to 0 here draw a line connecting these two points and then label the graph so this is a graph for fx equal to 4x plus 1 next example 4x plus 1 for x less than 5 for this example we have domain x less than 5 we still need x equal to 0 and y equal to 0 which is 1 and negative 1 over 4 and we must include the domain x less than 5 so the last end point is 5 when x equal to 5 y equal 21 x equal to 0 y equal to 1 here 1 x equal negative 1 over 4 and x equal to 0 starting point or the end point is x equal to 5 and y equal 21 since x is less than 5 so 5 is not included mean 5 here is a circle and then connect these two points with starting point x equal to 5 so linear graph is a straight line this must be a straight line so please use a ruler line must exceed the point negative 1 over 4 stop at 5 stop exactly at 5 okay then label the graph fx so this is a linear graph for x plus 1 with domain x less than 5 means for x greater than 5 there are no graph or no lines for x plus 1 for x between 1 to 5 for this graph x equal to 0 is not in the domain because x start from 1 to 5 so no need for x equal to 0 and for y equal to 0 also x equal negative 1 over 5 and since it has a domain from 1 to 5 the domain must include in calculation x equal to 1 and x equal to 5 when x equal to 1 y equal to 5 and when x equal to 5 y equal 21 then sketch graph here x equal to 1 y equal to 5 included and when x equal to 5 y equal 21 not included connect these two points x equal to 1 up to x equal to 5 not included then label the graph fx equal to 4x plus 1 extra example fx equal to 2x normally for linear graph we need x equal to 0 and y equal to 0 
but for this case when x equal to 0 y equal to 0 and when y equal to 0 x equal to 0 so you will have a dot x0 y0 and for linear graph we need two points so cannot use x equal to 0 and y equal to 0 in this case we need two points x equal to 0 and let's say x equal to 1 when x equal to 0 y equal to 0 and when x equal to 1 y equal to 2 we'll have two points x equal to 0 y equal to 0 and when x equal to 1 y equal to 2 we connect this two line with a straight line then label the graph fx equal to 2x for quadratic function we have four steps first shape Okay, shape for quadratic function, we have smile graph and set graph. Smile for a greater than 0, set graph for a less than 0. This is a set graph, this is a smile graph. Second, maximum or minimum point, calculate x equal to negative b over 2a. Substitute x into y to get maximum or minimum point. Then sketch graph. The last one, find the xy intercept. x equal to 0 and y equal to 0. Both fx equal to negative x plus 4 squared. So this is a quadratic graph since it has x squared. First, shape. Notice that negative here, so this is a set graph. Okay, maximum or minimum point since this is in the form of completing the square so x is inside the bracket x plus 4 equal to 0 so x equal negative 4 and y is plus constant outside the bracket plus 0 so maximum or minimum point is negative 4 0 third one sketch graph and then find intercept or domain if any is set graph maximum minimum point negative 4 0 so negative 4 is here and 0 so this is a minimum going up and then down again make sure your graph is a smooth line if there are any intersection, calculate the value for x or y intersect. So this one here cross at negative 4 and then we have y intersection. y intersection is when x equal to 0. When x equal to 0, y equal negative 16. When y equal to 0, x equal negative 4. And don't forget to label your graph fx. Example, fx equal to negative x squared plus 2x. Again, the same step, shape. Look at the x squared function here. Since x squared is negative, so shape is set graph. Maximum or minimum point, x equal to negative b over 2a equal to b is 2, 2, a is negative 1 and then x equal to 1 when x equal to 1 y equal to negative 1 square plus 2 times 1 so y equal to 1 therefore maximum or minimum point is 1, 1 and then sketch graph then intercept or domain if any Maximum or minimum point is when x equal to 1, y equal to 1 here. Set graph, so start from below going up. So this graph we cross at axis, either at x equal negative or positive value. So since we already know it will have x intercept, calculate the point. 0, y equal to negative 0 square plus 2 times 0 equal to 0 and then when y equal to 0 negative x square plus 2x 
to x equal to 0. So negative x, x minus 2 equal to 0, x equal to 0, and x equal to 2. Okay. So when y equal to 0, x equal 0 and 2. When x equal to 0, y equal to 0 means the graph will cross x0, y0. And when x equal to 2, y equal to 0. Also, we we'll cross here. And then connect the points with linear graphs. Start from below and then going downwards. Then lastly, label the graph. Next example, fx equal to 3x square minus x plus 2. Shape, look at the x square. x square is positive, so smile graph. Maximum or minimum point, x equal to negative p over 2a. Negative, negative 1 over 2 times 3. 1 over 6. When x equal 1 over 6, y equal to 3 times 1 over 6 square minus 1 over 6 plus 2 equal to 23 over 12. Therefore, the maximum point is 1 over 6, 23 over 12. Cash graph, then find the intercept. The shape of the graph is my maximum minimum point 1 over 6 and 23 over 12. This graph is a smile graph so it's going up and then this is the minimum point. So the graph won't cross as it exists as it will be up here. And sketch the quadratic smile graph. Then we know it has a y intercept when x equal to 0, y equal to 2. And last, label the graph fx. Last example for quadratic graph fx equal to x minus 2 times x plus 1 for x between negative 2 and 3. For this function, shape is x times x, positive, so smile graph. Maximum or minimum point, we need negative b over 2a, so expand x square minus x minus 2. So maximum point, x negative b over 2a, negative negative 1 over 2 times 1, x equal 1 over 2. When x equal 1 over 2, y equal to 1 over 2 square minus 1 over 2 minus 2. y equal negative 9 over 4. Therefore, maximum point is 1 over 2 and negative 9 over 4. Sketch graph intercepts. For intersection, x equal to 0 y equal to 0. When x equal to 0, y equal negative 2. When y equal to 0, x equal negative 1 and 2. And then since this graph has domain from negative 2 to 3, include the domain in calculation. When x equal negative 2, y equal to 4. And when x equal to 3, y also equal to 4. Maximum minimum point 1 over 2, negative 9 over 4. X equal to n negative 2. When x equal negative 2, y equal to 4. And when x equal to 3, y also negative 4. Catch the graph. In quadratic graph, label the graph x equal to x minus 2 and x plus 1. 
these are your exercise please submit the exercises at the end of this lecture